In this lesson, we'll cover the HDR settings used to customize how HDR is rendered on the MV. Here we have the HDR settings menu. Typically, the defaults are sufficient, but let's dive into some tweaks to optimize your HDR experience. Starting with the look setting, this controls the overall look of HDR. Your choices range from natural, balanced, punchy, to vivid, increasing in intensity. Punchy is the most popular and the default option. If you're a purist, natural or even balance might be your go-to, while Vivid amps up the punch, delivering even more pop to the HDR experience. This setting and the others discussed here are best adjusted by pausing a bright HDR scene and observing the changes as you cycle through the options. Next is the brightness preference. This adjusts the overall HDR brightness at the cost of HDR spectral highlights. For setups with a peak luminance below around 75 nits, setting this to plus 5 can enhance the brightness if the general image appears too dim. However, for brighter systems, neutral is advisable. Adjustment speed affects how quickly the Envy adapts interesting contrast. There should never be a need to change this setting from the default of 100%. Highlight recovery, a proprietary component of the Envy's HDR tone mapping, preserves fine detail within the bright highlights while still delivering maximum brightness. The default setting is high, however, many users prefer this on Insane. Yet another proprietary feature is our contrast recovery. This adds depth to HDR by enhancing contrast, akin to lifting a thin veil of haze off the screen. The default setting is low, however, many users prefer high for its additional clarity and pop. Shadow recovery helps dynamically enhance details in darker portions of a scene, particularly beneficial for projectors with lower contrast. Try this set on off, low, and higher settings to find your preference. Note that using this feature can result in slightly elevated black levels. Color tweaks for fire adjust the HDR rendering of fiery elements like explosions, with balance being the recommended setting. Global saturation and highlight saturation enable you to balance HDR brightness and saturation according to your preference. This balance is important as even the highest end home theater projectors lack the peak luminous necessary to simultaneously deliver both intense brightness and super deep saturation in scenes that demand both. These settings therefore provide the flexibility to prioritize either brightness or saturation as you prefer in such demanding scenes. Note that in most scenes, these settings will have little or no effect. A good scene to test these settings is the duel between Harry Potter and Voldemort in Goblet of Fire. Pause on the fireball scene around the one hour and 55 minute mark to adjust the settings from minimum to maximum and observe their effects. Remember to save any changes made to these settings to the base layer or to a profile. Now that we covered how to customize ACR settings on the Envy, it's time to move on to our next lesson.